corners that the existentialists turn to, but my favorite one is the metaphor of Sisyphus pushing the rock up the hill. Everybody knows about Sisyphus pushing the rock up the hill. Now, there's a lot of ways to read that metaphor. The rock itself could be whatever it is that you are hoping for. The top of the hill is where you're trying to get to, and it's your hopes and dreams that get in the way of you realizing the success of your life. Sisyphus spent all of existence trying to push a rock up to the top of the hill, and he never got to get to the top. So that's a metaphor for our lives, all of us. Whatever your personal rock may be, your rock may be you're not having you're not having fun. Maybe you got seven televisions and there's nothing on any of them, and you're not sure what that means. That could be the rock you're pushing up the hill. Or maybe you just bought yourself a brand new car and you don't look any better than you looked before you bought the car. That could be your rock. Everybody's pushing some kind of rock. spirit of the great spirit and in the words of Johnny Griffin happy in spite of conditions we turn to Albert Camus who in the great essay you're with me on this uh, Alexis we discussed this Albert Camus in this in the sisters essay he said the only way to make sense in the existential meaning of, of life is to picture Sisyphus happy he can't get to the top, he's pushing a boulder, he's under a sun, it's 99.9 .9 degrees, it's hot out there, he never gets to the top. How can you make sense if this is our existence, the way you do it? You picture him. So I want you to picture a man and a rock and a real steep hill. Uh, the sun is so hot, even the shadows can kill. He's got to keep on pushing, he's trying to get to the top, uh, but the forces of nature, they make him He's down on his knees in a world full of pain But time after time he gets back up again You got a picture You got to picture him happy You got to picture him happy Now the sun is the truth and there's no place to hide The rocket's time passing and Time will abide. The hill is just the shape of a, all things to come, and the man he's just suffering in the heat, of the sun. He's trying to find some meaning in a world that don't care, but the rock don't talk, and the hill won't share. You got the picture. You got the picture. Here.
distractions. So my soul, I can't even breathe the air. And it's an eye for an eye, and everything is fair. Try to find some meaning in a world where there's none. There's just this rock and this hill and this god awful sun. But when you get to the top, you'll see a terrible thrill. You'll see a song until I came across it. <laughs> now there are some words to the song. Uh, and uh, I was up in Harlem two nights ago at uh, some foodie affair. Uh, I don't know if you've noticed there are no more neighborhoods anymore. All the neighborhoods are gone. All over the world. It's like one big shopping opportunity. Shopportunity. It's a big shopportunity out here now. Uh, but there was still some patina, some feeling being in Harlem and, and being in touch with what that might have felt like. So uh, this is uh, some original lyrics to uh, Duke Ellington's Drop Me Off in Harlem. Where do you go when you're feeling so low? And what do you do when you're feeling so blue? Take a tip from one who knows you got to live your life cool repose Where do all the people go When it's time to start the show Ah, you can bet they're on the set Why don't you drop me off in Harlem Where do all the people meet When they want to feel you They go uptown, spread the joy around, drop me off in Harlem. Every night they fuss and fight, ah, but they do it with their horns. Nobody dies, there's no demise, they're all too busy being born. It's still the final word today. It's the greatest getaway. Grab your ass, baby, hit the tracks. Drop me off in Harlem.
to uh, be doing this next tune for a couple of reasons. Uh, it's a tune uh, that I, I wrote about, uh, I don't know, eight or nine years ago. And you know, you spend a, a lot of time trying to write a good tune, and sometimes you get lucky, sometimes you don't. Uh, this turned out to be the tune that's closest to being a jazz standard that I ever wrote. and. Uh, I wrote it in Mexico, and I think there's something to that. You've got to get out of the forest in order to see the trees. And to help me deliver this message, there's a wonderful singer named Hilary Gardner who uh, has uh, fallen in love with the tune and uh, graciously agreed to come out tonight and sing this with me. Put your hands together for Hilary Gardner, please. He knew what he signed up for The look in the field That run down appeal The passing ship The distant shore Don't cry for no hipster saw the writing on the wall It still gives
drives him home Just another slippery slope A deeper truth he can't recall Ah, but when young becomes old If the truth set him free Until then Don't cry for no hipster He had his day He had his night Call it what it is Gardner, thank you. Beautiful. Beautiful.